Okay, today on HammerDroids.net we're going to have a look, bit of a look at Swipe, which is um, a keyboard basically, but it's a keyboard with a bit of a difference. Instead of just punching on the keys, we're going to swipe over the letters oh dear, yeah, that we want. If you can see that. Did a pretty good job there, except for the letter that I had to just double check with me what I wanted. So occasionally it does, uh, it will get them wrong and it sometimes needs to ask you. Some of the tricky ones, for example, put and out are very similar. What you do is you bounce from letter to letter. If you want a double letter like stools, you loop round the, well that was it, no I got it. You loop round the letter that you want the double of. Uh, for punctuation, so for example if I wanted an exclamation mark, I can swipe from the Z down to the space bar. It puts an exclamation and puts a space on the end. Or the question mark to space bar, or comma to space bar, full stop. If you want to get a number or one of the other characters on the top there, I can just hold down that key. And there they are. Um, but it's also clever if I wanted to do like a smiley, for example. There it is. Very clever. Um, I can switch to the symbols by pressing the symbol key and then I can punch them all directly in or I can hold down to get to the pound sign look there for example. If I go back to the main keyboard I can get to the pound sign a little bit quicker. If I hold down the L, there it is, it brings up a whole set of different options. Um, if you want a capital letter, let's say I'm doing someone's name in the middle of a sentence, start on the G, way off at the top, grey, um, and it capitalises the first letter look. Um, that's about it really. So Swipe, it's not actually available just yet on the market. It's uh, it's in beta, which I'm lucky enough to be testing. Um, it, as, soon as, it out, as soon as it's out, we'll let you know on hemmerdroids.net. Very good. I couldn't be without it myself. That's Swipe.